Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here and today we have another great video for you guys. Now, um, we're going to be doing some Dynamite in Chill Cave. Now, I've been pushing a little bit this season. Um, I'm unsure about my intentions for next season. Originally, I was going to push, but I, I played uh, today's Sunday and I'm already kind of bored of pushing. Um, you guys can see I hit 20k, about 20,325 trophies. Um, we were 6th in the world earlier this season, but I kind of slowed down like due to me getting bored. So I'm down now to 15th. But anyways, um, I just wanted to thank you guys for the support yesterday. I'm going to put on the screen a showdown tournament that was actually hosted by Lex and Kairos. A little bit of a graphic. We actually won that showdown tourney. So for you guys who have been, you know, around the channel for a long time, know my struggles in showdown, you know, maybe I'm coming out of my shell a little bit. Maybe I can be a pro showdown player. As you guys can see, I beat many other pros um, in this showdown tournament. I came first place. Shout out to Jigsaw for coming second. We actually had a very epic one-on-one -on -one final. Um, but yeah, there were so many of you guys in that chat supporting me. I'd say like 70% of the chat was supporting me and 30% of the chat was supporting everyone else. So it was super, super dope. Um, you guys, you know, supporting me means the world and I'm very happy that it goes outside of my channel and you guys support me everywhere. So if you're in that chat and if you watch the tournament, let me know in the comment section below. But with that being said, we're just going to be playing with Jigsaw and Ash in some chill caves. So let's hop into the first game. Okay, so here we go into the first game and we actually have a really, really good comp. Um, Poco, Rosa, and BB is a very dominant comp in a lot of maps, so I definitely recommend running something like this. So we're just going to go straight up and kill the Jesse. Uh, we did a lot of good work, which forced them back already, even though we did die. Uh, they're already trapped into a corner, so that's super, super good. Uh, we have them right where we want them. Now we're just going to chill in this bush. We're going to make a little bit of an aggressive move towards this Poco over here. Hit him towards a wall so he is trapped. And we're just going to move up and get into this bush now. So Ash is going to give us a little bit of heals with the star power. Just kind of chilling in this bush. We're going to throw our ball. It's probably going to come back and hit a couple people. We're able to get some kills there. We're not going to be able to finish off that Jesse. Jesse's going to be able to get us. We should have just ran away. But we're looking super, super good so far. Uh, six to nothing as of now. They did just pick up their first gem. We're going to get close to them and kind of spring them back again into Jigsaw. And Jigsaw is just going to go off. You guys can see he's doing an amazing job as the rose so we got nine gems right there but jigsaw is low so hopefully you can get out we are going to pick up the next gem jigsaw is unfortunately going to die so it's not going to get us countdown we're going to hit this poco into the wall use that bounce to hit the jesse and the gene as well we're going to be able to get both of them we are in their spawn though unfortunately oh we just charged our super off of that jesse so we're just going to run back at this point going to swing at them going to be able to get them low Again, going to keep swimming, uh, swinging towards this gene. We're going to be able to get that kill. Jigsaw is kind of cleaning up in their spawn. I'm just going to run over as well. Looks like a fun time in here. And yeah, that's going to end the game. We had a really good first game. We did a ton, a ton of damage. We definitely should be getting that star player. We actually just destroyed them. Let's hop into the second game and let's see if we can keep up this domination. So here we go into the next game, and they're actually running Bo BB Shelly, which is a really good counter to our comp. We're probably going to have to take on this BB over here. Obviously, a big key with BB is keeping your distance and trying to get that first hit. Um, they do look like they are trying a lot with this comp, as we are. Um, a lot of people just like to fool around on ladder, but they're, they're not taking this as a joke. So this guy's hugging this wall really well. We're going to make get him to waste his knockback swing. Jigsaw is going to go down. Again, this guy's playing the walls very well. Uh, none of us have really done anything to each other. I'm going to be able to knock him back, though. Hopefully, Ash does give us that heal. He's going to give it to us. We're going to use our ball right here, and he's going to be able to swing us two times before we can get him, but we're able to do a lot of damage to them, and we're going to be able to push them back, and that's going to give us a 5 to nothing lead. Uh, Ash is very low. They do have mines over here. I'm going to try and trigger them. Try and swing at this Shelly over here. As it is very low, we're going to be able to pick up that kill. The BB does have ball, so Ash doesn't want to go too close just because there could the she that she does have knock knockback and the ball, so a lot of damage can be done. We're just going to use this wall over here. Okay, we're actually able to only hit this uh, the Shelly once. Oh, we almost picked up the kill. We were very very close. It looks like Jigsaw is going to be able to pick up a kill. Oh no, the BB actually knocked it back. Okay, I don't know exactly where the Shelly is. Always have to keep an eye on that. Gonna get that knockback over here. Gonna use the ball. Swing one more time. Gonna be able to pick up that kill. 
Oh, I thought I shot. Okay, we're gonna be able to get that BB. Let's see if we can get a snipe on this bow. Okay, we weren't able to kill it, but we're able to just not let it recharge. Obviously that Shelly is super, so we don't want to get too close to it. We're gonna try and knock it back. We are gonna be able to do so. The Shelly is getting closer. Uh, probably shouldn't be too much of an issue though. We're gonna be able to take it out. That's gonna end up very, very hard, but really, really good second game. Uh, you guys can see that they did run basically a full counter. So that was a really, really good dub for us. Let's hop into the third game and let's see if we can continue making things happen. Okay, so here we go into our third game. We're gonna be facing a Crow, a Poco, and a Nita, which is obviously a really good comp. Uh, Nita works everywhere, one of my favorite brawlers to play in the game, and just to play with, just because she's so versatile. Uh, we're gonna try and get as close to this Crow as possible. We're gonna knock it back right into Ash, and Ash is gonna be able to pick up that kill. Uh, we're just gonna take a very aggressive stance in this bush. Hopefully the Crow doesn't come to our side and poke us. He's not going to. We're gonna hit him up against this wall and just be able to get a really easy kill. Uh, we're gonna get a lot of ball bounces over there on the Poco and be able to take it out pretty much with ease. Hopefully we can get over here without the crow hitting us. We are going to be able to. Gonna throw that ball, just gonna go back and forth and bother, bother the Poco and the, and the Nita a lot. Looks like Jigsaw is going to go down and Ash is in a very, very aggressive position. So hopefully he can get back without dying. Okay, he had his heal, so we are fine. We're gonna be able to hit that Poco over there. That was a really good ball actually on our end. We're able to get our super back. So we're doing a lot of kind of just going up, doing a ton of damage, dying, and resetting, which is kind of what you want to do as a BB. This isn't a brawler where you just hold a lane and keep position. It's a very, you know, aggressive brawler, and you want to play aggressively. You don't want to really hold back too much. We're going to be able to take out the Poco. Um, the Crow should be taken out. Okay, we're going to be able to get the Crow as well. We're just going to chill over here, and, over here and heal up. Ash does only need one more gem to get countdown. We're just going to put this ball over there and just let it do its thing. It's gonna do a ton of damage. We're gonna be able to get another one. We're gonna be able to take out the Nita with it, and we're just gonna run back. Ash is gonna get his 10th gem, which can allow us to go aggressive. We're gonna be able to get that Poco over there. We're gonna try and hit this Nita against the wall so it doesn't go too far away. We're gonna be able to pick up the kill. Just gonna hit the bear, and that is going to end the third game. So we're just dominating right now with this BB Rosa and Poco comp. We've gotten start every game with BB. We're doing a great job. Let's hop into our fourth and final game, and let's see if we can just go undefeated with complete domination the entire time. Okay, so here we go into our fourth and final game. We're gonna be facing another BB, which is obviously gonna be a challenge. They're running a Penny and a Barley, which is basically the meta comp for this map. We're going to try and get this BB to swing first. Or we can just push up over here, but we don't want to leave Ash alone. Get a swing. They're not going to be there, uh, but we are going to be able to take out that BB. We are going to obviously go into this aggro position. We want to push them either into this wall or the wall right up there, just so that we can continue uh, getting the kill. Or we can push them into the side wall. It doesn't really matter. We're gonna be able to get that hit over there. Actually, it might go down because we got hit four times by the or three times by the bubble, which is huge. A uh, really good play by that BB. So we're gonna go up again. I'm not really too focused on not dying. I'm kind of just going as aggressive as I can. Okay, so there was someone in there. I wasn't too sure. I'm gonna make a swing. He's gonna be able to get to me. Ash. Oh, that was like really late with the heal. Uh, but still, good thought by Ash. He was going for the right play, just didn't really get it at the right time. Uh, oh, a little bit of a server lag over there. I am just going to rush this BB. Actually, I'm going to move to the side over here. I meant rushing the Barley. Just because the Barley, I can go a lot faster than it, so it's going to be a pretty easy kill. We're going to be able to get it. We're going to be also able to hit the Penny twice with our ball. Only issue is we do have this guy below us over here. Oh, how was I not in its range? We are going to be able to take out that penny, but we are going to go down. Uh, so we do have nine gems, which is really good. Unfortunately, we do have this BB below us, but I don't think it's going to do too much. It didn't really have the smartest play, so Jigsaw is going to go over there. He's going to pick up a gem, and we're just going to be following this Barley around. We're not going to let it, you know, go anywhere near getting a kill. Ash is getting pretty low, but he does have his heal. We're going to use our ball and just track this penny down, not let it go anywhere. We're going to be able to take out the Penny and the Barley, and it looks like it's going to end the game. It will. So that's going to be the end of the four games. So hopefully you guys did enjoy uh, watching me play with BB. I think I'm going to get a 1K this season since I'm not pushing anymore. I might as well just go for a few 1Ks. I do already have Rosa 1K, and I'm going to be making a video on that likely 
in two days just because i have a tournament later today i'm going to try and get out some tournament gameplay for you today but anyways that's going to wrap up the video i hope you guys enjoyed and let me know if you guys want to see any brawler 1k literally any brawler in the game let me know and i think i will get it 1k either this season or next just let me know so anyways i hope you guys enjoyed the video that's going to be all for today peace